In this test, the peer was subjected only to lateral displacement to induce shear stress. As can be seen in the top right plot, the response increases linearly at first, indicating no permanent damage to the peer. Eventually, small diagonal cracks form on the front face toward the top of the specimen. The cracks open and close based on the direction of the displacement. Cracking is accompanied by a softening of the structure, as seen in the loss of linear behavior. Shortly afterwards, the reinforcing steel begins to yield, as illustrated in the reduced stiffness of the response, and finally in the reduction of measured force values that are associated with increasing applied displacements. After substantial displacements, shear failure of the pier occurs. This permanent damage is accompanied by a loss of strength and is evident in the large cracks which develop through the specimen, along with the spalling of concrete that occurs before the final failure. This failure is accompanied by a sharp drop in force resistance, which can be seen in the response curve. The specimen is then taken through a cycle of increased displacement to assess the post-peak behavior of the pier. This includes strength loss with increasing displacements and is not possible to accurately predict using computer analysis tools.